So everybody's talking about AI in advertising, some of it even from the biggest brands. Much of it's promising, but let's be honest, a lot of it sucks. So we put AI to the test on a food commercial spec to see what would work and what wouldn't, and be transparent about the whole process. We started with a traditional tabletop shoot. We built the burger, we lit it, we shot it, locked in the hero look. Then we used those real images to train a custom AI model. We generated a lot of images to match the real burger in an actual environment lit properly. 80% of it, not production ready. Some of it was just weird. But the other 20%, that's where it got interesting. All right, if you had to guess which of these is AI and which is original. Ding, ding, ding. It's really starting to get good at photorealism. We generated endless deliverables across multiple creative styles that can be used in any context. Let's say you're a DP or director and you wanna have ultimate control over what we're seeing. So you could take any camera, even an iPhone, shoot a stand-in burger, and then use that camera tracking data to train the AI model. Through this, we're giving AI the language of cinematography. This isn't a magic button. You need a very highly skilled team to be able to prompt, iterate, and quality control to provide a client and the audience what they want and expect. We're currently in May of 2025. And honestly, in just a few weeks, this is probably gonna be outdated. But that's not failure, that's the pace of innovation. That's how fast this is evolving. We're showing what's possible right now so we can keep building towards what's next. This was trained entirely on client-owned assets, no internet scraping, and we're working closely with our legal team to keep the process human-led, clear, and future-proof. We learned, yet yeah, there's a lot of really interesting and valuable commercial opportunities. There's also a lot of AI hype out there. It's not replacing commercial production anytime soon. Where is it going? We predict it will completely reshape how we imagine, scale, and deliver content. And we're just getting started. Also, as a fun experiment, we decided to deep fake my entire interview using this image here of me. A couple of others like it. Similar workflow as our burger, where I'm puppeting that with my gestures and my voice on my iPhone shot here, my apartment, a little help from my producer, and that's it. More to come.